If you haven't noticed from the past few years, Google has been focusing a lot in its deep learning technology and from which they believe that the new Assistant could be the future. The Google Assistant is one of the finest AI available for a smartphone. It's a new way to make Google search, but in a conversation with an AI that knows a lot about you. Google is planning to make the Assistant available everywhere. It is the same AI that powers your Google Allo and your Google Home. Anyways, in today's video, we're going to test the Google Assistant and let's find out what she's capable of. Hey Google, what's your name? Did I forget to introduce myself? I'm your Google Assistant. Hi. Nice. Let me go a bit personal. Hey Google. Do you have a sister? Wait, is it you? Hmm, interesting. This is gonna be heartbreaking. Are you human? I've been told I'm personable. <laughs> Better to put that way. Sing a song for me. La 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 Who's your father? My engineers are always there for me when I need something. They're like my family. I shouldn't have better asked the question. Do you ever sleep? I take power naps when we aren't talking. Pretty much the Google Assistant is really fun. But it's time for us to test the efficiency of the Google Assistant. Open WhatsApp. Who do you want to chat with? Shivin. What's the message? YouTube. Got it. Do you want to send it or change it? Change it. What's the message? Hi bro. Got it. Do you want to send it or change it? Send. Sending message. That's exactly how efficient your Google Assistant has been built. It can almost open any of your application and if supported, it can be controlled further with your voice. Like the WhatsApp or the Play Music. The most interesting thing that caught my attention was the flight timings. Search flight from Chennai to Hyderabad. And then instantly pops up a Google card showing the flights and the duration for travel and starting price. Further, you can filter by choosing a particular flight, Emirates. One way flights on Emirates from Chennai to Hyderabad leaving January 31st start at 13,812 rupees. The shortest flight is about 10 hours and 5 minutes long. That's pretty much all the information are required. Like all the other voice assistant, even your Google Assistant is capable of doing mathematical calculations. What is 0 divided by 0? That will be the reply when she doesn't know an answer. What is the value of pi? Okay, here goes. 3.141 And there she shows her when she knows something. Hey Google, how does a cow sound? Here's the cow sound. <laughs> that was a tricky question. Your Google Assistant is more than what your Google Now was. It is a combination of Google's deep learning technology and the TensorFlow engine, which got recently open sourced by Google. Besides asking questions and using voice commands in Google Assistant, you can also play games. To start playing a game, you just have to say I'm feeling lucky or let's play a game. And your Google Assistant will go into full show host mode. There are few games you can play with your Google Assistant. And there's one called as the Mad Lab, where your Google Assistant turns out to be a host and it keeps asking you questions and finally builds a story on it. And the best part is that the story does make sense. The Google Assistant is not just a chatbot. It gives a feel of talking to a real person. The voice assistants can be judged on the basis of how adaptive the assistant can grab the native slang or be more efficient as to understand on how a human brain works. Google has taken the world of AI a step further with this Google Assistant, which they are planning to port to almost every device in the near future. Either way, thanks for watching. Your Sully Droid Sector, our Sully This Life.